we pick only the best from Amazon and bring it to you. And but wait, there's more. <laughs> to bring you the products you never knew you needed. <laughs> One of your dogs used to open and close doors with his nose? With his nose? All right, that's talent. That is talent. Okay. First up today, we're going to take you in the way back machine. <laughs> That's right. We are going back to the 70s, baby. Back when Mima and Papa were just little, little tykes. Uh, depends on when in the 70s I was a little tyke. <laughs> Time travel, yes. And these are some of the things that we used to get for Christmas. And I thought I'd bring them to you guys. You got coal? No, I didn't get coal. Okay, first up. Can I get over here? We used to have to play with sticks. That's right, sticks. Pick up sticks. <laughs> we we always got these. <laughs> I didn't. You never had pick up sticks, Papa Bill? No. <gasps> oh. It think about it as if you dumped out a whole box of toothpicks. <laughs> the only, only they're longer. It's like shish kebab sticks. The, the only time I had to pick up sticks was when Grandma would send me out behind the woodshed to that weeping willow tree and tell me to oh, pick a switch. You don't, you don't want to pick that stick. That was the stick I had to pick. And don't come back with a short one either. What was back in your days that isn't here now? Um, I don't know. Because apparently all this stuff is still around. Oh, the arguments as whether something moved or not. Yes, yes, yes. Yeah, pick up sticks. And they're cheap, too. <laughs> you think we have that exact container at home? Yeah, we don't. I don't have any right now. But, yeah, we, oh, we always had them. And we had a box at Grandma's house, too. It was these and that, that guy with the magnet. Face? The face, yeah. Where you drew the beard on it? Yep, where you put the beard on with the magnets. Maybe that's why you're into bald-headed guys with beards now. Yeah. Patch up telephones with cords. Yes, yes. We still have one in the house. I, lo I love telephones with cords. <laughs> if I had a lot of money, I would have a collection. We've got two right now. I've got, like, one of the old box. The wooden boxes. Where you crank on the side? Yeah, with the crank on the side. I've got one of those. And then we've got an old, it looks like an old desk phone. Yeah, it's an executive desk phone. Yeah, rotary it's, dial. Yeah, rotary, rotary dial, baby. <laughs> go rotary or go home. None of this digital crap. That's right. <laughs> there's old and new, but there's always a middle. <laughs> you should pay attention to that. <laughs> Wait, hold on. It took you 20 years to notice the sticks were worth different points? Huh? The sticks are worth different points? Yes. By color. I didn't know that. I didn't mean to have it, and I knew that. I just learned that. I didn't know the sticks were different colors. We just counted up the sticks and see who had more. Oh. That puts like a whole other level onto this. <laughs> telephone booth. Oh, I would love a telephone booth. <laughs> uh -huh. Have you seen the video that shows teens trying to figure out how to use a rotary phone? Get out of here. I <laughs> they couldn't figure out a phone. <laughs> no, I never read the rules, Chrissy. <laughs> it's like Monopoly. You don't read the rules. Because you know how to play. It's just innate in you. And apparently, 
I played Monopoly wrong, too. Okay, who? Who? <laughs> Everyone makes up for it for free parking. Yes! When you, when you have to pay fines and stuff, we put it in the middle. And then whoever lands on free parking got all that money. Apparently, that's not how you do that's it. That's not how you do it, though. <laughs> that's how we did it. <laughs> yeah, what's with that auction rule? I, I never played with that either. <laughs> yes, yes. <laughs> oh, see? Everybody plays it that way. All right, let me, let me get you the link for the sticks. Because apparently, there's a whole, whole new way to play this. Bam! There you go. Pick yourself up some sticks. <laughs> and read the yeah. rules. And read the rules. <laughs> I slay me. All right. And this was always in our stocking. We always had one of these every year. Bam! Those little water games where you press the button. Oh, yeah. yeah, yeah. And the water makes the little rings float around. <laughs> yes. Or the little ball. Or... Yeah, yeah, yeah. We always have one of these. <laughs> yes, yeah, so frustrating. <gasps> Imp, you never had one of these? Oh, they come in all kinds of, I was going to say flavors. But they had big ones, too. Yeah, there, there's a demo right there. <laughs> but yeah, oh, I could, could never do them. They'd make me crazy. And then they'd start leaking in so, your in your closet, in your toy box. So your folks weren't really into the artsy, crafty stuff then. Well, my, we had some of that. Well, my mom would always throw in the, the big bag of popsicle sticks and maybe a bag of clothespins. Or box of toothpicks. Oh, no. We, a little artsy a pipe cleaners. That was the other thing. You got a bundle of pipe oh, cleaners. Oh, Jason's shorts are on. <laughs> yeah, no. We... Okay. Sometimes. Only sometimes the shorts are on. For you, it was Pez, Silly Putty, Slinkies. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was... The, the slinkies, I always wanted to make them go down the stairs, like long stairs. But uh, we lived on a, in a ranch. Troll! What? <laughs> Hold on. Okay, there's the watery thing. <gasps> the book of lifesavers, Chrissy! Yes, yes! Yes, always in the stocking, the book of lifesavers. <laughs> oh, and did you guys get the coins? The chocolate coins? Those were good, too. Have you seen that slinked vid? Slinky vid. Oh, slinky vid. Uh, no. No. Lego was the king of your playroom. Guaranteed hours of creativity. We had some Legos. Like my brother got Legos. And I'd play with his Legos. See, we never did. My parents went Lincoln Logs. Yeah, we had some Lincoln Logs. Do you still have feet now? Feet. And we played hospital with the Smarties. Our Lincoln Logs always became drumsticks. I remember playing doctor, but there were no Smarties involved. <laughs> yeah, no, the Smarties. Those were your pills. That was your medicine to make you better. <laughs> At most, we'd get down like two steps, and then it would mess up. Yeah, no. We had like three steps in front of our house growing up outside. On the stoop. We had a stoop. You once made a nine-foot Lego tower complete with radio antenna on top. 
Holy smokes. I, I'm not, I was not as skilled with Legos. But wait! There's more. Okay, these we were talking about, and and I, I found them. I found them. They're like romper stompers. They're essentially plastic cups <laughs> that you stand on and you walk around with them. Baby stilts. I love them. Yeah, like baby stilts. <laughs> Your kids would kill themselves. <laughs> oh, but yeah. Barry, how you doing? That's why we can't have nice stuff. <laughs> yeah, I love those. I love those. I had to bend over, though, because I was tall. Oh, yeah. Romper stompers. Oh, what does it say? Non-slip treads on top. Safe for carpet, concrete, grass, and wood floors. No. I I would not I would not advise these stomping all over the wood floors. Just Get saying. Out of the concrete. That's right. Is this the 70s? It is, Jason. This is 70s thing. This is taking me ma back. Shag carpet. That's right. Deep pile shag. If it was, oh. if it was early 70s, you had that inch and a half. We did. Carpeting. We did. Ours was dark brown. Ours was a dark green. We had dark brown shag carpet in, baby. <laughs> and you could like rake designs into it. Yep, yep, yep. And your your little little army men could hide in there. <laughs> They'll ban lawn darts, but still sell these. I don't, I don't think they're that bad. <laughs> they're they're safer than a skateboard, I think. Cause how fast could could you go, really? You can't run in these. <laughs> Those carpets were Lego traps. Yes, the Legos could stealthily hide until you were in bare feet. You probably did more damage with croquet mallets than lawn darts. <laughs> you used to play hopscotch? <laughs> Chrissy! How many broken bones did you have? Oh my goodness. Oh. Okay. <laughs> Next up, this one's for Papa Bill. Oh wait, patch up. I remember the lime green car. Oh, lime green shag carpet and the green vinyl couch. Our dog would chew the sofa. A little green pieces could be seen in the backyard. <laughs> <laughs> oh no here we go this one's for Papa Bill rock em sock em robots baby yeah buddy I never had them <laughs> Aww. I had to go to the neighbors yeah I, I wanted uh, my brother had them rock em sock em robot oh wait Batman vs. Superman. You had multiple versions of it? Hold on. There's a video, baby!
when there's videos. I love when there's videos. <laughs> oh, where's your parachute pants? This is the perfect music. I had I had a pair of those. I did. <laughs> and parachute pants were 80s, really. Yeah, I was about to say, we had bell bottoms and a lot of jeans. Jeans jackets, yeah. jeans shirts. Jeans everything. <laughs> And tie dye, tie dye. <laughs> Parachute pants with with the hyper color t shirts. Oh, all the neon. Oh, I had all the neon stuff. I love the neon. <laughs> the bright orange and pink and green. <laughs> yeah, you could see me glowing at night. <laughs> you couldn't miss me. <gasps> Patch up, hungry, hungry hippos. That was a good one too. <laughs> oh yeah, rock 'em, sock 'em, robots. But wait, there's more. There's more. Okay, this one was always under the tree as well, and I can't. <laughs> I remember we played it. I don't know if we played it correctly. Probably not. <laughs> Probably not. <gasps> Holly Hobby! Yeah! I had her lunchbox and her <laughs> and the doll. <laughs> yeah, Holly Hobby. You had a Jean Little House on the Prairie dress. <gasps> I love Little House on the Prairie. Oh, I read those books Did over and over and over and over. A what doll? Betsy Wetsy? No, I never had Betsy Wetsy. But oh, Little House on the Prairie books. I loved them. I loved them. All right, ready? Here we go. Millborn, baby! Who remembers it? Come on! That was you. I can't be the only one who yeah, had this you're game. You're the one who told me about it. <laughs> All right, Barry had it. Chrissy did too. It's it's a card game. It's a, it's a racing card game. It's it's kind of like Uno but not. That I got to move these guys. <laughs> the, the humble's over my ears. Loots tomorrow, loots yesterday, but never e ever loots today. I gotta move those. Catch me if you can. Patch up. Thank you for the follow, hun. We have you now. One of us. One of us. <laughs> you still got your box, Phalanges? Dancing Phalanges. Dancing Phalanges. We need to record that. So when Phalanges comes in, it just says that. <laughs> but yeah, I had fun with it. <laughs> It was a good game. Yeah, but we ha always had card games. So here you go, Imp. You need to you need to play this. <laughs> You've played everything, Imp. You need to play this. <gasps> Waterworks, yes. Oh, let's see. Is there a video? No. There you go. It looks like they've updated the cards a bit. Not much. <laughs> okay. What I want to know, hang on, I'll put it in chat. But yeah, oh, I remember, I remember the, the lights. <laughs> Viewmaster, yeah. Of course you had a Viewmaster. <laughs> Oh, but wait, there's more, there's more. Okay. Oh, your brother still has his. We have one in the library. Two. Oh, we got two. Yep. That's how I first saw Disney was via Viewmaster. 
<gasps> Soccer poppers! Yeah! <laughs> Yes, yes! My brother and I beat, a, beat each other up with those. <laughs> it, it was sanctioned, sanctioned sibling rivalry. <laughs> Here, stick these on your hands. Go beat up your brother. <laughs> oh. You got the metal handle. Nice. <laughs> The original scatter metal. Yeah. Too. You're trying to remember the name of the one that you hopped on. It had a ring. Oh, oh, uh, up. Uh, oh. Hopper, hop, hop, hippity hop. A hippity hop. Yeah. We had a hippity hop. I wanted the horsey one, but it's it was too small. So we just had the one with the ring. But they had one with the horse head. What about shoots and ladders? And yeah. Oh, yeah. Shoots and ladders and candy, candy land. land. Yep. And these. Now, I didn't have this exact one. But I, I brought you a, an example. <laughs> but this is what girls were forced to play with. <laughs> Are you ready? We had paper dolls. They were just cardboard. <laughs> cardboard dolls. And you put clothes on them. <laughs> and I found I found Alexander Alexander Hamilton. <laughs> King George the Third. <laughs> he can't see his head. <laughs> but oh, oh, they got a lady too. Who is this? Elizabeth Hamilton. <laughs> yes, but paper dolls. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> I had fun with them, but <laughs> but that is old school. <laughs> no one here. I don't want to deny you guys. If you want to pick up the... If, like, the vinyl clings. <gasps> the vinyl clings? Oh! Oh, what were they called? Uh, not Shrinky Dinks. Oh. Well, the Shrinky Dinks were the ones you melted down in the oven and made the little... Yeah, thing. yeah, yeah. But the vinyl clings, I used to... Stick them on the refrigerator or wherever. Oh, they they were called something though. What were they called? Oh, you were the kid who got all the Fisher Price Adventure people. Oh yeah, color forms. Yeah, yeah, color forms. Oh, we had all kinds of those. Yes, yes. Oh, hold on. Hold on. I'm going to see if I can find them right now. I bet they still make them. They've got them on Amazon. Color forms. Yeah, I'm, look I'm looking them one up right now. Oh, this is like this is, I remember this. Disney's Frozen. But this one has the little guy. I remember the little guy, that exact logo. <laughs> yeah, color forms. Holy moly. Oh, but if you got them dirty, then they didn't stick. So you yeah. had to lick them. I, I would never lick them. Yeah, you got to lick them. <laughs> you had to lick them to clean them off. Get all the dust off of them. <laughs> you had the color form version of paper dolls, so I had the whole books of color form outfits. <laughs> I used to, remember, um, you'd stack them up. So you'd have like an 
inch thick <laughs> of these things. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Oh, man. Does anybody remember Weevils? Weebles wobble, but they don't fall down. <laughs> <laughs> And the wolf! For that Coming in with that six month three sub! Whoop, hold on. <laughs> I gotta move my mouse. We are in double digits, baby! Whoops. It's a super streak! Super streak! It's nine month. Oh, six month streaky. You used to... nine months. <laughs> well, look, there's a video. Oh, yeah, and they had the shapes. So you had to make things just with the shapes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Forms has come a whole long way. Yeah, magnetic. Woo. Wow. <laughs> light bright. Oh, yeah. Making things with light. <laughs> light bright. But wait. There's more. Guy on the ground hit by a car. Where is the color forms ambulance chaser? Your color forms lawyer. <laughs> okay, now this. See, you guys are getting on my nerves over there. <laughs> I love you, True Gaming, but I gotta move you. <laughs> Can I do that? Yeah, I'll, I'll move him later. You had the felt stuff, no licking involved. <laughs> Color forms judicial center place. <laughs> All right. My dad was very, well, still is very into avionics. He had model, model uh, cars and motorcycles and helicopters. Hey, Brit! Covering me, Moss Face. That's how she makes her money. <laughs> How's it going, Brit? <laughs> and if you have not checked out Mr. Brit Wolf, click on that link that'll magically appear in chat. We were we were playing some football this morning with Brit. And what? Yeah, the new Madden game. We were checking that out. 
but you will love him. We have coffee and chat in the morning, and then he he eventually plays a video game. But he could chat the whole time. That'd be fine with me. <laughs> this is why we can't have nice things, Britwell. <laughs> oh. So anyway, Dad loves everything that flies. Oh, he even had boats, too. Every every RC thing there was, Dad eventually built it and, and flew it. Or drove it. Even or, if it was a boat, he flew it. That's right. <laughs> I, I, I think a few of the boats actually flew. <laughs> but, we always had one of these kicking around. Let's... You ready? Bam! It's a helicopter! On a stick. <laughs> and you just flew around and around in a circle. <laughs> and you tried to pick up those guys or trip your sister who's walking by. So who had one? Come on. I, we can't be the only family that had this. <laughs> Did the cat eat the other one? <laughs> Getting used to a new keyboard. <laughs> You've never seen this, Imp? Oh. Hey, and they've got a little guard around their their blades. Shadow Biohazard, hey! You've seen these, but you never had one. See, Bass the Mighty. Oh, heck, my uncle had one of those. See? Okay. All right. I am vindicated. Wait, that's right. We had the f blades. They were free. And you could try and chop things up in it. It wouldn't, of course, but... Talamar's coming in for a landing! <laughs> but yeah, we always had one of these. And then, eventually, that stick <laughs> would get bent. <laughs> and then... And fly all over with the bent stick. <laughs> oh. Okay. Sometimes it's just for me, okay? <laughs> oh. So here you go. Get yourself a helicopter. <laughs> That was fun. Brit, thank you for those loots. It's terrible when your stick gets bendy. <laughs> yeah. Oh. All right. But wait. There's more. There's more. Okay. This was another item. <laughs> Along the same lines as the paper dolls. While, while... The boys got the helicopters on a stick. On a stick. On a stick. We got this. Fashion plates. <laughs> where, where you rubbed? You rubbed a pencil <laughs> across a template, <laughs> and it made. Like an imprint. <laughs> yes. Switchy had them too. Yep, yep. Yeah, they were big. They were big. Oh. Fancy carrying case now. <laughs> yeah, that's the plates. <laughs> Way, yeah, this was the step up from Paper Dolls. <laughs> this was like the high tech version. This... This was where every little girl was going to go into fashion designing <laughs> by just switching out these plates. Oh, wait! There's a video! <laughs> a video? <laughs> you, you were just left with shaving the dog and dressing it up. I mean, normal things. <laughs> oh, yeah, we dressed up the dog, too. <laughs> Hold Can on. Did you shave it first? No, we did not shave the dog. We don't need it that loud. Yeah, look at that. Look at that carrying 
case. That looks like one of my knitting carrying cases. And put nail polish on it. Yep, yep. We put nail polish on our dog. <laughs> black, black. Future fashion designers. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. How's it going? Hi, <laughs> How's it going, Dad? <laughs> we we weren't talking about you or anything. <laughs> Love you, Dad. <laughs> we're we're just going through uh a little a little nostalgia from the seventies. <laughs> <laughs> oh, good, good. Did you get a lot of rain from the hurricane? <laughs> there you go. Get your fashion plates. Get in the high, <laughs> high fashion industry on the ground floor. <laughs> the 70s, before consumer affairs started protecting us from toys. <laughs> we had lawn darts, toys with lead, small objects to swallow, <laughs> all the good stuff. <laughs> That's right. Uh, everyone in the Pinto off to Disney. Oh, I have told that story, Dad. I have told them that story. <laughs> and we wept. We wept. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, they they know the story <laughs> of the journey in the Pinto with no air conditioning. <laughs> uh, <sighs> but wait, <laughs> there's more. There's more. All right. And while the ladies were rubbing their pencils, <laughs> The boys were, were stretching their appendages with Mr. Stretch Armstrong. <laughs> all he did, all he did was stretch him. <laughs> the ladies were rubbing whose pencils. <laughs> oh. That's all right. He's looking as good as ever, too. <laughs> Our own. I don't know. He doesn't look like uh, he's held up that well. He, he looks like the same guy I remember. <clears throat> no, not me. No? No. <laughs> <laughs> Brit! My dad's in this channel. Mom says hi. <laughs> <laughs> Send mom love. <laughs> oh, of, co of course we tried to break him. <laughs> I've never seen what's inside. Who took a knife to old stretch when they were kids to see what's inside? What is inside? I I I should look that up on the YouTube's. <laughs> there was goo. I would think he's just like, like rubber bands. Were we that high tech back then? Wait, there's a video. He saved the world once. Stretch Armstrong. <gasps> Look at that kid's hair. <laughs> wow. Now Stretch Armstrong is back. Stretch Armstrong. Your stretchable superhero. <laughs> Stretch him four times his size. He becomes bigger than a building. <laughs> Tie him into a knot. He always goes back to his original shape. <laughs> and you can stretch him again and again. Stretch Armstrong. Stretch the return Armstrong. from Jazzwares. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh. <laughs> There you go. Oh, you need.
need to reminisce with Stretch. <laughs> Barry, could you grab that real quick? All right, Dad. Have a good night. Love you. Oh. Or just use him to knock over Lego towers. <laughs> but wait. There's more. Okay. Now that's what we were playing with. Hold on. Who else remembers G.I. Joe was a full-size doll? Yes! Yes! Yeah! With his kung fu grip! And the talking G.I. Joe. And... Oh no, the frames! Okay, we're back. I remember when they went to that little rinky game thing. I was like, yeah. what are they doing? Remember when you could shave him? Shaved G.I. Joe. What exactly were you shaving? No, no, you... All right, come wait, on. Wait, wait, wait. What were you shaving on G.I. Joe? You could shave G.I. Joe. Who who Did remembers you that? a little handy strip or something? No! You could shave his beard. <laughs> you, you could... <laughs> the, the, all right, I'm not... This is not a dream. There, there was a version... You could shave his beard. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> You're on your own. All right, I'm going to Google it. I will. I, uh, <laughs> is it like G.I. Joe, Gia Pet? No. Oh. There was a G.I. Joe with a mustache and beard. Yeah. I remember it. Uh-huh. But you didn't shave it. No, no. Unless you had a brother who really <laughs> loved that doll, and you being the demented hey, sister. Hey, Jade. Where, oh, he's got a beard. <laughs> Let me shave it off for him. You could shave Teddy Ruxpin, too, but you shouldn't. <laughs> we could shave our dog, and we shouldn't. Oh, Phalanges, you don't remember the bearded Joe? Yeah. I remember the bearded Joe. I had one. Mustache, beard. You can feel the hair and the beard and the mustache. But you couldn't shave him. You're good. You're good. <laughs> Watch out! Raid coming in. Raid. H bomb girl coming in with that raid. <laughs> yeah, dude. How's it going? Chloe, how you doing? Oh, so what were you playing, H-Bomb Girl? Was it fun? Was it exciting? Were you overwatching again? <laughs> if you have not checked out Miss H-Bomb Girl, you must click on that link that'll magically appear in chat and give her a follow. Check her out next time she's on. Dead nebbit. <laughs> yes, yes. So, you finished a duet? <gasps> Watch it! You, you did one of our duets? <laughs> Hold on. <laughs> she has the best mod on Twitch, a.k.a. you. <laughs> Shadow Biohazard, welcome, hon. <laughs> All right, we'll look, that, we'll look that up right after, right after. Let me see if I can find it. Um, let's see. I got to go over here. Do you have any spaces? No. Let's see. Let's see. Uh, did you clip it? It should be in your videos, maybe. Uh, did you clip it? It should be in your videos, maybe. Clip it. Oh, here we go. Oh, here we go. Wait, 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 <laughs> wait, I don't know if it's gonna, all right, you can see part of it on the screen. Here we go. Treasures on 
told How many wonders can one cavern hold? Looking around, who do you think? Sure. She's got everything. I've got gadgets and gifts and tricks and tricks. I've got hoosets and what's its color. This is my favorite one. You want thing with us? I've got 20. Yes. But who cares? No big deal. And you're singing so nice. <laughs> and then I do that. Betcha on land, they understand that they don't reprimand their daughters. Oh, dear. Yeah, we're getting into the Chris. <laughs> the Chris Ridge. Girl, you sound great. <laughs> She's got those young lungs. Where she can hold the note. <laughs> oh, we love you. <laughs> that was excellent. Oh, thanks. <laughs> oh. Mwah. Love you, Heidi. <laughs> that was your first ever safe video. Oh, jeez. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Oh, all right. Now, we're going back to the 70s. Back to the 70s. <sighs> now, you saw everything we played with, but you may wonder, hey, what were they wearing on their feet? Well, everyone who's anyone had these. That's right. The knee-high tube socks, baby. Oh, yeah. Right <laughs> yeah, I have the tube socks. <laughs> they came in all colors. But... <laughs> Patch up. It's okay. It's okay. There's not much. <laughs> you can still get these bad boys. <laughs> Oh, there's no video. <laughs> I like how they give you the back view. It's the same as the front. It's a tube. <laughs> Coordinating stripes were key, yes. Oh, the brown knee highs. Yes! Oh, I had every color in. I had every color. <laughs> yes, to wear with skirts. Yep. I had brown and green and black. I had all the colors. And plaid! I had plaid! <laughs> so is the sixteen ninety nine version for three-legged people. <laughs> I don't know. Oh, oh my goodness. Oh. 
So I can I can definitely vouch for these being authentic. And they had to have that red, white, and blue pair. Yep, <clears throat> yep. And you know what you needed to go with these, don't you, Pop Bill? But wait. There's more. There's more. You needed these, baby. That's right. The headband and wristband. Yep, yep. <laughs> Saddle shoes. Yes, Chrissy. <laughs> you had to have sweatpants. <laughs> you couldn't exercise without them. And it was a requirement. Because <laughs> apparently your wrists sweat a lot. And the shorty shorts. Yes. <laughs> I can't even look at those now. With your Walkman and Xanadu soundtrack! <laughs> I love Xanadu! <laughs> and tube tops! Yes! Oh, the tube top. <laughs> that, that's before I even had anything to put in the tube. <laughs> tube socks were dangerous? Oh, I was going to say, what are, you, what are you doing, Chrissy, with those soup socks? <gasps> terry oh, no, cloth! No! No, the terry cloth! Oh, no. <laughs> yes! Oh, oh, I just can't. Oh, wait. Okay, I'm, I'm cringing here. I'm cringing here. We wear short shorts. <laughs> I can still remember one of the guys in the neighborhood. This is my dad's age. Doing lawn work with the terry cloth short <laughs> and a tank top. And a tank top. With his wristband. With his wristband. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I want to gag. I want to heave. <laughs> Satin short shorts for Saturday nights. <laughs> Just hair sticking out. Oh yeah, you had. You didn't even bother buttoning those shirts. The, on the guys. The gold chains and the roller skates. <laughs> yeah, the roller skates. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh. Oh, yeah. Nair. Nair. I remember Nair. Hey, <laughs> yeah. Nair, I think Nair, I got Nair. scars, Chrissy. <laughs> Still from Nair. Nemo wears uh, shorts, shorts. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> You're waiting for Richard Simmons to pop out of the woodwork any moment. Oh my goodness, Imp, I had totally blocked the terry cloth from my mind. <laughs> oh, wow. Oh, oh, you can get these in any color. You can get, like, flags of all countries here. <laughs> oh my goodness. Okay. Ser serious question here. It may not seem like I'll throw it in chat. Valor anything. <laughs> I had Valor. I had Valor. Oh, you could probably use that to stuff to edge glass. <laughs> oh, oh. Oh, my goodness. Okay, confession time. When Nair came out, which ladies were brave enough to try a self Brazilian? Papa Bell! Oh, the poor lady that <laughs> looks like she hasn't seen sun in years. Yeah. Oh, she's Brit Wolf Pale. That's like a whole new level. She must be wearing those wristbands all the way up her arms. <laughs> she's, she's Brit Pale. <laughs> it, it's a new level of pale. She's Barry. almost pale enough to blend into the white background. Boss Liberty has it going. <laughs> oh, but wait. There's more. There's only one more. Now this took the seventies and the socks and put them all in one for you. I bring you. The American mullet socks. American. <laughs> Your socks oh. can have a mullet. 
plentiful. Actually a pretty neat game. <laughs> I don't know why. I don't know why. I don't ask why. We don't ask why. Oh, I'm but wait, there's more. Socks and not any other articles of clothing <laughs> that have that big bundle of hair hanging out. Oh, there we go. An action sock. An action shot. <laughs> Bianca! Hey, hon! How's I real been treating you? For the testosterone deficient man who can't grow leg hair? It's like the opposite of Nair. <laughs> right? <laughs> we went from Nair to that. <laughs> it could be worse. It could be shorts. That's, that's, oh, 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 Baba Bell! <laughs> Think about that one. You wear these with your shorty shorts and you go roller skating so the hair can blow in the breeze. <laughs> oh, hey, my <laughs> Oh, my goodness. Oh, corduroy pants. I loved corduroy pants. They made that shush sound when you walked. Yeah, it's called Christian Burns. <laughs> They're a little too warm for Florida, and that, guess where I was living when I had a pair of <laughs> I love to go to rice. You can braid the hair and add beads. <laughs> oh, oh, is there a video? Oh, I, please let there be a video. No. Aw. There's no video. <laughs> oh, oh my goodness! You guys, you guys make my face hurt. <laughs> uh oh, Papa Bill's coming over. Well, no, no, I gotta... Oh, we need our our yeah, hoosies. <laughs> oh, okay. Drink them if you got them. And speaking of, we've got a sponsored segment brought to you by Stoke. You can have a pair of pantyhose with a strip of hair running down the back of both legs. Oh, hey, Bo. Oh, no, no, that's no. <laughs> that's not right. <laughs> Someone running up in corduroy pants. Zip, zip, zip. <laughs> oh, 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 it's dead in the seam, yeah. <laughs> oh, it's a cold brew streak. Cold brew streak. It's caffeine streaky. <laughs> That's it. That's it. We gave them a you gave them their own jingle. They don't even know. They'll be getting the jingle for free. <laughs> oh, all right, H bomb girl. Thanks for coming over, hun. I appreciate it. Oh, okay. Ah. Oh wait, I didn't give you the link. I don't want to deprive you. <laughs> Here you go. Oh, and they're in stock, in case you were wondering. Gender neutral, one size fits most. 